Hello and welcome to an episode of Tag Wars PT 2003, the core showcase, and we're off to Royal Birkdale. Let's get on with it. Let's see how this one goes. Last time we played quite well until the end. This time we are seeking perfection. We will want the birdie streak for the full 18 holes. Why are the blue and the black tee so close? Supporting that. I don't know. Either way, the wind is quite significant, so it will fly. I want more power boost than that. Billy, give me a moment here. I'll tell you where this is. There we go. The smoke hasn't cleared yet. Almost 400 yards out of that. Give me a good roll. Yeah, that'll do. That'll do. Just whack it. Commentator say, saying anyone can make it, ramping up the pressure. I've got the white shirt again. I forgot to change it again. No, oh, well. The second hole heads towards the Irish Sea and is virtually straight with a bunker in the center of the fairway on the approach to the green. Yeah, right, once again. Five bunkers guard the green and rough banks protect it. Fairly straightforward until you get to the green, but I, I suspect the wind will be will be bad. Yeah, it's not, it could be worse. Bit of a risk because the bunker might not be in there. We're fine. We're fine. About a flop shot, yeah. Play a flop shot. There we go. Right by the hole. Can't moan about that. Cannot moan about that. Tap it in, baby. There's a birdie to go to two under. If the putter is out of my hands, you can't go wrong. You can't go wrong. Royal Birkdale runs parallel to the second hole and presents an excellent chance for a birdie. A tee shot down the left side flirts with very heavy rough, but also gives an open. Right, okay, you're fine until you get to to the green. Oh, this time the wind is is bad. Didn't get all of it, but it'll do. A tee shot like this will usually work. Hopefully, hopefully that's a lob wedge. Lob wedge won't be enough here. It's going to go too high. You want to drive it in there with a sand. Control love wedge. Commentator is clueless. He's got this one heading right at the Say, point, Billy. almost got it in. Almost got it in. Smooth start here. Smooth start. Let's keep it going. The fourth tee sits high above the third green, and club selection here will be influenced heavily when the wind blows in off the ocean. It's the longest par three in the course, and the green is very well protected by numerous deep bunkers. Oh god, the wind is bad. The wind is bad, and it's I'm going eight iron here. I've gone down two clubs. Oh, where's the wind? It's hard to be unhappy after I love a mile and I'm a uh, wind game. No, it shouldn't matter. We're getting the birdie anyway. The fifth hole at Royal Birkdale is a short hole that dog legs to the right. There's deep rough on both sides of this fairway and the long right, what we've got here, okay. protected by seven hellacious bunkers and slopes severely. Once again, you finally get to oh okay. I'm guessing I don't get the loft out of that that I need to actually pull it off. Second shot's gonna suck. The wind's gonna be dead against it. Wedge won't be enough here. It's gonna go too high. You want to drive it in there with a sand wedge, I think. Oh, I don't think I don't. With this wind, I think the sandwich is gonna suck. But uh, I don't trust the pitching much here. I'll play it safe. The sandwich will get on. I just think it'll play well. Sure, I was right. Yeah, that'll work. It's on the green. 
What's this one look like, David? This one looks like it'll Effectively took the safety shot. It's a big putt here to keep the bird streak going. Oh, I've done the opposite. The last episode, when I missed the putts, I overdid it. So I thought, okay, I'll pull it in a little bit. And because I've done that, I under I underdid it. I under compensated for the break. Short par five though, we can make that back uh, uh, up here with an eagle. Wind's not not that bad either. There we go. Very short par five this. I'm being honest. Right, we'll play, play, play this one a little soft because the wind will carry this. Oh, this is all over it. Only, only a little bit. I'll go on. Oh, it's a double eagle! We could be looking at a, three here. a double eagle! We could be looking at a three in my ass. We've got a two. Oh, it's brilliant. I think that's the rarest shot. I mean, Look at that, I may have even got one during the Tiger Challenge or whatever it's called. I think it is the Tiger Challenge. I never got a double eagle. That is my first double eagle on this profile in this game. That is how rare they are. They are rarer than holding ones. A new elevated tee has been built on this hole, adding 21 yards to its length, and it plays into the prevailing wind to a That's how you do it. Protected by seven more bunkers. Oh, God. That wind is bad as hell. All right, six iron plates safe. Just get it on the green. Well, it's up. It's in the air. It's over the hole. Yeah, that'll do. Oh, no. That's actually that's actually a pretty good shot in that in that in those conditions. If I'm honest, I'm taking that. Yeah, I'm taking that. There we go. I was about to say that means I'm one ahead of target, eight under par, but I got the double eagle. I went from behind target to ahead of target on one hold with that shot. Alright, left edge will get blown to the right, should be fine. Blast it! Oof, the wind didn't, didn't do as much as I thought it would. But it's in the fair one. Okay, I think pitch and wedge will work out fine, actually. Oh man, if this is the right club, Billy, it's a beauty. I think we've, worked, it's, 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 we've, we've locked out there a little bit. Bit of backspin, control it, close approach bonus. Not quite, but still, five feet. This will make it Can't complain. Oh, are you kidding me right now? I mean, it plays short. I think the caddy was wrong there, if I'm honest. I, th I think the caddy lied to me there. It, it needed a little bit, bit of power to help it along. The caddy's fired. I fired many caddies in my time. He disposable. Get, 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 get gone, caddy. If you can't, g if you can't give me a good tip, you, you're useless to me. The wind's in favour. This, no, it won't get there, but we can get into very close, very close range here. He's gobble like this one's just smashed down the middle. Yeah, the hell will stop it, but we can kind of chip that on. No, you can't chip in this game, can you? Ah, nail it. Ah, back to the early ways. Okay, that's nine under par, so we're only on. We're just on target, thanks to a double eagle. The opening hole of the inward half is a sharp dog leg left that puts a lot of emphasis on the tee shot, with a bunker on the right about 260 yards out. All right, well. Anything left of center here makes the approach difficult to a sheltered green surrounded by typical Birkdale sand hills. The green right, you want to kind of. We're going to try and cut the dog leg. Um. Actually, we're gonna, we're gonna go for the hole. That's what we're gonna do. 
Please don't hit the tree right in front of me. He's got this going right at it. There we go. That's, a shot. That's how you do it. Just cut, uh, go across everything. That's a very. I, I should make this putt. I should make this putt. Oh god, it's very, very sensitive. To build a bit of a buffer. Oh, that's a bad putt. That's a bad putt. It's a birdie, so I can't really be moan about it, but still, that is a very poor putt. That really is. That's it. That's the easy putt, and I've blown it. The pressure got to me. That's very disappointing. Oh, well, let's move on. But the shape of the green could provide a tough pin placement in the back right where rough borders the putting circle. Okay, green's right at the front, which means if we're playing the the approach shot onto the green. You might want to duck, guys. You know, we can get that one in. Oh, the wind's full. Oh. Uh, that, uh, I don't know what that last one was, but we have uh, we have a chance from here. Oh, nailed it! This for Bert. There we go. We keep on target. How many how many par fives are they on this course? We need more. Please. Green set between two large sand dunes. Hole always plays the full yardage and leaves absolutely no room for error. Eight iron should be the right club with the wind helping here. Oh, uh, I should have gone power boost, I think. Just to be safe. Should be safely on the green. No, never mind, that'll do. Oh, I don't know if this person has got relatives in the crowd, but they're just going daft down here. That's a fantastic shot. Why has it got so little power on, you know, on on the default? Is it is it really really that far up hill? Ah, it's a short shot. Uh, I've, I've got it the wrong way around here. There we go. Nearly messed that one up as well, just by misreading the carry tip. I was like, hang on a minute. That's very sharp for such a short putt now. I was overdoing it. Sides of the fairway, and a ditch lurks menacingly down the left. Bunkers left and right of the green tighten up this approach shot, and the hole plays directly down the prevailing wind. And sh right. here we go. This should be in perfect shape. Despite the wind, we've kept it in the fairway. We'll take that. We're gonna play the nine iron well right to play this one safe. Got it to a safe. Should've gone eight, eight iron there, but it's on the green. Very tough putt coming up though. Very tough putt. Yeah, that's a poor putt. For par. It's a it's a not Mary's green really. Twelve under par today. But we are behind target. We need a par five. We need a par five. These par fives, these greens are our nightmare. Not exactly a breather. The tee box is set deep in the sand dunes, so players will have a tough time gauging. Will be a good time to get a hold in one though. We're gonna play the six iron. Oh, it stopped dead. There's just no movement on these greens. If I knew it was going to do that, I'd have done front spin. There we go. We get the birdie. Okay, big par five here. We need the eagle to get back on target. 
The wind's a nightmare. But that's a perfect shot. But we need another in this wind. We think we can reach it from here, David. Playing it safe, going well to the right. Keep going, keep going. It's another double eagle! Oh my days! Two double eagles in one round with 20 man hour wins! Jesus Christ! What a shot! Oh, thank you very much, I'll take in that! We stay on target, we once again go from behind the target to ahead of the target in one hole. Another double eagle. Here we go. The green is large and raised, making deep bunkers left and right difficult to negotiate. The wind is bad again. But we can clear all the bunkers here, so it's not as bad. Let's smash it. Yeah, I gotta love that one. That's enormous. It bounces over the bunker. Got a bit lucky with that. We'll take that. Play an approach shot. That should be okay. With wedge. That'll do. That will do. This for yeah, straight in. Right, it's a par five. If we can get the eagle here, if we can get the eagle, a recently built team now makes the we'll make sure we hit the target the unless we have a nightmare on the 18th. Hold is a slight dog leg left, and the two tiered green is guarded front and rear by more mine shaft bunkers. Okay. Oh, the wind's against it. That's going to suck. Blast it. This looks good, Billy. We just need all the distance we can get with that. We'll take that. It looks like we could have a shot at the green here. We got a shot, but we need the power. To iron. Oh, it's gone right. Okay, it's on the green. We'll take that. That's not bad. We did it. On and Hard to do much more than that without being without uh, being very very this aggressive with that. Put the foot eagle, and to make sure we hit the target. Here we go. Oh. I just can't measure these up. I really can't. Still a bit of pressure. But we just need to avoid the bogey. A par will do. A par will do here. The home hole at Royal Birkdale is a magnificent. A par will do. Which once again requires a great tee shot. Longer hitters might try to drive over the lone bunker on the right, giving them a shorter approach. This green was once very flat, but recently it's been raised right, and contoured to make it considerably more difficult. The wind is bad again. At the pressure moments, the wind has picked up to try and screw us. It has done so now. Look at that wind. Pressure moment. Big moment. Target in jeopardy. Apply the 9-9 out of the wind here. Oh, what a fantastic shot out of the rough. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. We're going to get the target. We're going to exceed the target. 19. Under par to finish. We needed two double eagles to do it. But by God, we've done it. Beating the low round. Oh, so that's the uh, foolish pause. Oh, 
it was the lowest score. It's going to show me everything apart from that, isn't it? Of course it is! There we go, 20, no, 19 under par, 19 under par to finish it. For now, thank you very much for watching, and I will see you next time.